Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a very special video for you. I finally have an apartment tour. For you guys that follow me on Instagram, you know that I moved out from my old apartment. I actually have a video of that old apartment tour up on my YouTube if you wanna check that out. I'll link it for you guys down in the description. But I moved out. I lived at that old apartment for 13 years, so like pretty much half of my life. And I finally decided to move out with my fiance. We now lived on the west side. And yeah, I have an apartment tour for you guys. I know I've disappeared from YouTube. It's been five months, it's been quite some time. But I'm ready to start filming for you guys. I'm settled in into my new place and I'm ready to come back to the tube. <laughs> I'm ready to come back and I'm ready to show you what's been going on in my life. To start off with, like, I don't even have colored hair anymore. I'm like a brunette now. <laughs> Tell the camera if you like your new home. You like your new home? Do you like your new walkies? Do you like your new neighborhood? Tell the camera. Do you like going on your new walks in your new neighborhood? Yeah? You like that you have a dog park in your new neighborhood? Go tell him. Tell him. Enough talking. Here is my updated non-influencer apartment tour. As soon as you enter the apartment off to the right side we have the kitchen the apartment is freshly remodeled and i love what they did with the kitchen i love that it is open concept and the kitchen looks out to the living room i love drinking coffee every morning look at the backlash backlash is not backlash backsplash of the coffee bar i do have a keurig then my mother-in-law upgraded me to an espresso machine i have my milk frother i also keep my coffee pods in this drawer here i recently upgraded to glass straws and let me tell you it's a total different experience drinking out of those the apartment also came with brand new appliances i do have an electric stove which i'm still getting used to but i'm getting the hang of it this is the first time ever that i have a dishwasher i didn't grow up with having a dishwasher so i'm really excited about having one i also have enough counter space to put out all my appliances of course without overcrowding we don't want any clutter my mother-in-law coming through with a knife said even though this kitchen is not that big i still have a lot of room to put away all of my stuff the kitchen in my previous apartment was very tiny so this is definitely an upgrade and i do have a lot of storage as as you can see here i also have storage in the bottom and some of these cabinets are actually empty because i don't have a lot of stuff so there's definitely room for growth here is one last look at the kitchen moving on to the living room we do have a fireplace which i don't know how to use but i'm sure i'll learn once we have to use it we kept all of our furniture from the previous apartment i did a few things here and there to spice it up like this floral arrangement got the fake flowers at home goods this couch we've had since we've move in together for around four years and i mean it's just a whatever couch it works for now i do want to upgrade to a recliner but for now it works it's there next to the couch i have my two paintings that i did a bunch of years ago we also have matt's graduation certificates and his medals on our coffee table i have something very special so matt goes to the beach almost every day since we live very close by and he collects seashells so he went ahead and he put them in the bowl and as decor so of course i have to show you guys that and here's an overview of the living room our fireplace the kitchen and i just love the new apartment and i am so blessed to be living here with my fiance that i adore and i love and this is a picture of the most amazing day of my life and here is some decor that was gifted to us from tiffany's and this is the coach tabletop book and here is my old coffee bar from the old apartment that i have now converted to a knickknacks shelf that eventually i want to convert into 
a bar but i don't really drink so i don't know if i'll ever make it into a bar here is toby's little corner this is where we keep his bones and toys this is where he eats his food and my co-worker who is a talented dj and an artist created this for toby look at that he's so cute it looks just like him this apartment is a two bedroom two bath so i'm gonna start off by showing you the guest bedroom for now matt is using this room as his office eventually this will become my mom's bedroom as you can see this room is pretty basic we don't have much in here we do have a queen size bed and we have matt's desk there's floor to ceiling mirror doors that open up to the closet and as you can see there's a lot of storage up in the top and the closet is pretty spacious right now there's not much matt has a few things in there we have our christmas tree he has his mic in there so it is his office slash studio for now but he can't get too comfortable because eventually my mom's gonna come live with us. I'm still debating if I should decorate the room before she arrives or if I should wait for her to decorate the room together. This room also has a pretty spacious walk-in closet. Right now I have Christmas decor, luggage, and a bunch of random things low-key i'm still going to be using this closet even after my mom moves in there's still a lot of room for her including this storage under the vanity area mad made these decor mason jars with cute messages at the bottom a few years back for my birthday so cute and so thoughtful both restrooms have different layouts this one has the hand washing sink included in the toilet area give this video a thumbs up if you see what i see while i'm editing i'm eventually going to change the pictures in this picture frame to pictures of me and my siblings for my mom i chose this room as a master i like that the sink is pretty spacious it does not have a vanity space but i can live with that i also like that the sink is outside the shower and toilet area this restroom is smaller than the guest bathroom but i just like having the bigger sink this room also has a walk-in closet it is not as big as the other closet but it has enough room to fit toby's clothes but there's still plenty of room as you can see the closet is not maxed out whatsoever there's still plenty of room i'm not a big clothes person so i don't feel like i'll ever max this closet out but you never know we also have room for our shoes and we have our old drawers that we used to have at our old apartment eventually i want to replace that and make it more classy where it matches we also have our clothes hamper if that wasn't enough closet space we have another closet right across from that one this closet in particular is my closet and i could have chosen the other one as my closet but i thought this one would be perfect to store my bags because it has the sliding doors and my bags can be protected from dust i know some of my bags are in the plastic bags that can protect them from dust or like the dust bags but I don't know we'll work it out either way right now this closet works perfectly there's shelves so each shelf holds three to four bags down at the bottom i have a few of my shoes and on the other side there's more bags not only that i feel like there's room for growth on the top right now i just have a few like empty boxes and whatnot but i can get rid of those and i can put more bags there <laughs> this is not a bag closet i also have regular clothes here don't worry i really like that the rooms are pretty spacious at our old place all the furniture was touching each other and that's not the case here on the left side of the bedroom i have my desk and i keep my desk pretty simple i just have a little decor with my buffy book of course i'm obsessed with buffy in case you didn't know and I also hung my medals right across from my desk. I have my vanity and I don't really like my vanity setup. It worked for the old space. Everything was tight and compact and this vanity 
worked at the old spot the setup is no longer giving i was trying to replace it like a month ago but i was looking into different setups and i couldn't decide so i put a hold on the project i'll keep you guys posted when i decide to upgrade it so you guys will be the first to know it looks like toby might need an upgrade on his little steps as well one of the best things that i did was upgrading the bed to a king size even though toby is the only one that benefits from it next to the bed we do have our nightstands that i try to keep clutter free one thing that i never had growing up was the privilege to have the bed away from from the wall and it's so much easier to do the bed in the morning of course i cannot forget about my mexican roots so i do have my mexican cobija we also have a tv in the room so we can watch buffy all night for my birthday my brother's girlfriend gave me these cute window star decals that create rainbows and star shadows when the sun hits through the window it's something that i wouldn't bought myself but they are so fun and they make me smile there's a lot of things that I like about the apartment, including the baseboards that are all around the rooms, the crown molding in the kitchen, all the light fixtures match. I really like that it's really cohesive. They really put attention to detail. Now to one of the best parts is the spacious patio. We are on the first floor, so we are off the parking lot so we don't get as much privacy as we did in our old space but the spacious patio makes it worth it i have enough room for all my plant babies toby loves sunbathing outside so it makes it all worth it i hope you guys enjoyed this apartment tour i still want to do a few things here and there if you have any suggestions i would like to hear those down in the comment section below i'm just really excited to be back on youtube i miss you guys thank you for your support you guys still have been watching my old videos uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and i'll be posting a lot more videos and i'll see you guys soon you like your new home kobe